Hello YouTube, if you are subscribed and everybody to the remaining social network, you start King, and today we're back with more Basa Galactica Deadlock. Today we're going to see some of the other content in the Broken Alliance. The it's basically a mission pack with eight more missions once you start a new campaign, which I'm not actually going to do because well, it would be essentially most of the same over last time, e.g. me running away like a coward and still winning battles through sheer attrition. So, yeah. Don't worry, they're, they're, on, they're on YouTube, so you're gonna find them. However, we are going to check out the new ships. It's basically a new type of more aggressive battle star along with the supply ship of the Colonials and the predecessors of the modern, the modern EGE second Salmon War base stars with the, the predecessor of the Resurrection ship, which is also a supply ship. So yeah, it's a predecessor of the current uh, base and current battle stars, EGE the Mercury class, you know, the Pegasus. So, create new fleets, colonial fleet, uh, let's see... Colonial support group. Create. Okay, let's see. Okay, we we'll start with the command ship. It's going to be a Jupiter class, obviously. There. And we're going to go with uh, the Vipers Mark II. And. Uh. Give me my nukes. Arrow piercer. Ooh, the temptation. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, let's go. Yeah, let's go with guided for the the Jupiter class. The seeker. Okay, then we add the Minerva. E.g. the predecessor to the Mercury. In the flank. Okay, let's see. Okay, let's... Oh, they have... Yeah, like I said, they're more aggressive. Neat. Let's see, it has more missiles. Okay, let's see. We have my Mark 1 and... Sweeper, Target Vent, Assault Unit. Oh, right, the Assault Raptor. Hmm. Would I want to do... Go with boarding? I had to sacrifice some of the Vipers, so... No, not the, this ship, so... And, uh, you know what? Let's go with Nartemis, just to finish off the Tree of Battle Stars. Okay, let's see, right over here... Let's go... You know what, I've never used the... the uh, not that one, the EMP. The mines. Yeah, let's do this. Uh, your guide missiles. I wanted torpedoes. For the Minerva. Remember, the point of the Minerva is to go in, dish out stupid amounts of damage, and, uh, you know, leave the other battle stars to take most of the brunt of the assault. Okay, let's see. Manator, Adamant, Berserker, System. Celestra, I uh, not yeah, if I'm not mistaken, let's see. Support yeah. Okay. This the Wow, that's an interesting design. Let's see. So you're going to be at the back because you're a support ship, so let's see. Got missiles? What's the second one? Because it No, no, uh, uh, ah, dang it! Thought I had, I mean, picked the wrong ship. I didn't. Okay, so that's two battle stars now. I only have enough for one more ship. A Minotaur. You know, since this is a support group, obviously we want stupid amounts of firepower. <laughs> obviously. 
Okay, got missiles, got missiles. Let's see. Thorstra. So, the, they had the ability to repair the ships, so... Ooh. So, 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 so... You know, it's just drones. Nope. Yep. And now the Cylons. The support for it. Okay, so let's see. We have uh, the Argus, which is the new one, if I'm not mistaken. Yep, the Argus base star. As you can see, you can obviously see the the predecessor lines to the newest battle stars, battle star base stars. Speaking of which, as you can see, it costs a heck of a lot less material. However, unlike the... However, even though it has few... Oops. The old base stars still had some... Uh, kinetic weapons at the top and at the bottom. This one's... Ah, ah, ah. Guided missiles all the way. Also, let's do it uh, the other way around. So, yeah, I got missiles and... Uh, let's see... Scorpion Heavy Raider. Okay, let's add a second Argus. Perfect. Got the missiles. Stay. And, uh, yeah, let's add another one with Heavy Raiders. And you... Let's see. And uh, I'm adding... Oh. I see you. Normal rate is for the base star. Okay, now. That's uh, the base stars. Now, the support ship. Let's see. Dragnet, Bobos, Hydra. If I'm not mistaken, yeah, I think it was Hydra. No, the Hydra. Is... It is a Hydra. It is a Hydra. As you can see, it looks like a smaller version of the Resurrection ships. Remember, those were enormous. And the second one, right there. Okay, let's see. Do they actually have... Remind me... No, they don't actually have weapons. And like the Colonials, which added some missiles, they have absolutely no weapons whatsoever. So, let's see. Of course you need a Nemesis. And once again with guided missiles. And then we need a second Nemesis. Sis, 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 sis. With even more guided missiles. Okay, I still have uh, enough for one more ship, so... Oh, no, I don't, I actually... Right, I forgot, I can only have... S <sighs> I keep forgetting I can only have so many ships. Ah, uh, let's go with the servers. It was the original carrier. As you can see, the servers is basically... Or rather, the... The new base star is like a Cerberus. If a Cerberus and the OG base star had a baby. So. That's a lot of Vipers, by the way. Okay, got the missiles. Uh, Why'd I put the Cerberus? More Raiders. Okay. And those are both support groups. They're going to clash one-on-one, -on -one, and I'm going with the Colonials. Because I like the Colonials. Huh, only 20 points in difference. 
Okay, this should be a fair fight. Okay, let's see. Go on a support group. Versus... The Cylon support group. Oh, uh, support freight. Okay, let's see if I'm not too rusty. I haven't played Battlestar Galactica Deadlock in a bit. <sighs> and double number is something that's kind of annoying me. And the fact that I didn't give any mod support whatsoever. Hmm. <laughs> okay, let's see, what do we have here? So, this is the Argus. Interesting. You know, I think uh, this looks like uh, one of the ships we saw during the actual series, you know, the reboot. Battlestar Galactica. I think. It looks like it, anyway. Okay, you can deploy 300 plating times 2 to 600, which is actually quite a beating. Okay, then we got uh, this bad boy. Man, you can see the way it really is a predecessor to the Mercury. The, the no, it's this one is, but you can see. Unlike the Mercury, it doesn't actually have the second side. The the Mercury has a second side down here. This one doesn't. But other than that, you can see it's fixed, and the uh, the the spear part actually looks like the Mercury. Not to mention this one, if you. Remember the series, the Pegasus had it. The engine block uh, probably something that came about later. And uh, I'm not the biggest of fans of uh, the mid-hole, this part. As you can see, this part is blocking the field of view of these guns. Not too bad in the broadside, if you think about it, but it's, I don't like it. Especially in the Mercury class, I hate the Mercury, in terms of design. I mean... It's done for broadside, but... Well, what if the enemy... Appears from top of below? Well, there's, there's a lot of your firepower that's not shooting at anything. That's why I like the, the Jupiter class. No matter where you are, most of the guns are firing. That's a well-designed ship, in my opinion. And then we have the Artemis, which, you know, it doesn't have this problem. As you can see, all the guns, there's nothing obstructing them, other than the other guns. Which is why I actually wouldn't... If I was designing the Artemis, I'd move these guns to this part over here, this one uh, slightly to the side, and the last one uh, over to this area. You know, so that they weren't obstructing each other. But it's neither here nor there. Now. We're gonna have the... This bad... Let's see. You're going to go on full defense. Because, well, that's your job. So. On it, Commander. And uh, launch the Vipers. Understood. Oops. <laughs> My bad. Okay, keep it medium. Understood. Wait. Launching alert. Okay, time, time, time. The hell. Oh! <laughs> Misclick. My bad. Understood. I mean, it's not a bad idea. The guy didn't... No, these are torpedoes. 
this artifact missiles. Oh, anyway. Frack! I forgot to... Well, it fits. It's the oldest of the Battle Stars, so... The problem is that uh, Mark 1s are crap. Well, that happened. Okay, you guys... Oh, you don't have the... Oh, you don't. Huh. That... Well, that's gonna be a thing. Okay. This... That. Okay. Get yourself to the central part of the place. Uh. Ah. Okay, that's a problem. As you can see, because of the model of the ship is so tiny, I actually had quite a bit of trouble getting to it. On it, Commander. I think it's interesting. I can actually, unlike the Battle Stars, I can control the power distribution. Interesting. Anyway. Understood. Okay, good. Okay, launch everything. We got six squadrons. They've got a lot more. <laughs> I mean, this isn't even funny. Okay, let's see. Okay, is that target? Understood. I mean, I know what it is, because, you know, I built the fleet. Understood. Man, my Mark 1s are going to do jack and squat to it. I also want the Vipers out of the way. I'm going to start to moving into broadside positions. Actually, boost. Man, the Jupiter is so slow. Well, it makes sense. The the Minerva is supposed to be a far more offensive weapon, while the other two on it, Commander, were more. By the way, oh, I can actually. You don't say. Launching mines. No, not yet. Okay. By the way, if I... Let's see, let's see, let's see. What are the, all the turrets? Okay, it has the rear. Oh, they are considered the rear. Huh. Only four. And with no, yeah, and no way to shoot below. <sighs> the Empire made that mistake, and it cost them. We have the forward ones. Okay, remember, at this time we still didn't have the Mercury with the Mac guns. Well, they're still rail guns, they're just really, really big. Let's see, what? We got the broadside ones. The right, the same thing. Wait, they have... We have the eight, then which are the ones at the bottom? Oh, they do have four at the bottom. I didn't notice those. Hmm, why are they interesting? Okay, so they can shoot, shoot below, but why are they one is more up front than the other? Hmm. Interesting. Well. And this guy only have miss the missile launchers. Oh, alright. Okay, keep yourself in the middle of the fleet. Remember, your support ships. You're not supposed to engage. At best, you're supposed to be bait. But I prefer not go it that way. Eh, yeah, slightly above. Yes, Commander. Perfect. Okay. Vipers, make me proud. Uh, 
Okay, now. Stop boosting. Not quite. Perfect. Understood. And go down. Excellent. Okay, you. Neat. Let's see, how's that better like? Actually, yeah. Like still. You. On it, Commander. Okay, it's more or less the level of the Artemis. Then... Okay. You guys... On it, get Commander. into position. Okay. Actually, you guys go up. Yes, sir. You're gonna to be firing your missiles soon enough. And I don't want anybody hitting anybody that they're not supposed to hit. Ah, isn't that adorable? Fighter squadron is taking fire. Missiles incoming. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Okay, so those missiles are dead. Which means I can't uh, actually shoot mine. Which is annoying, but oh well. Okay, five pers. Hmm. Okay, let's start clearing, clearing up people. Two at a time. Understood. But only three. What the heck? Uh, they have so many more vipers. Where are uh, vipers? Raiders. Ah, there they are. Okay, they're coming. Okay, you focus fire. Go, Minerva. Focus fire. Go, Artemis. Focus fire. And Jupiter, you're good doing what you're doing. Okay. Slow down. Perfect. Yes, sir. And... Perfect. Okay, that's about a line I, I'm liking to, that I like to see. Okay, now. Ooh. And boom! Man, that's satisfying! <laughs> okay. Like I said, the Mark 1s are fucking useless. Okay. Okay, I need you guys to yes, move sir. up a bit. I need you to slow down a bit. Because I need the Galacticus flag, not Galacticus, the Jupiter class flag to cover for you. Actually, flag. Yeah, perfect. Next, the Minerva, I need you to focus fire on someone. Okay, and you guys slow down as well. You must be ready to deploy. Yes, sir. The armor plating at a moment's notice. <laughs> okay, next. Wait, what? Did something blow up? Squadron has gone dark. Yeah, like I said, the Mark Ones are crap. 
So say we all. Okay, so the raiders are approaching. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Understood. So, how are you doing? I didn't take damage. So say we all. So say we all. On it, Commander. Okay. Hopefully... Yes, Commander. That helps. Not because the missiles, but because the raiders. They're becoming a problem. Okay, where did... Well, the have boarded a battle star. Well, frack me! That's the problem. That's why we need the flak. Which one? Full defense. At least we got good enough marines. And, well, would you look at that? The rest of my ones still aren't dead. That's good. Okay, who else? Oh! They're boarding multiple... No. No. Only the Jupiter. Okay, other than that... Uh... On it, Commander. Uh, let's go for the left. Launching drones. Let's see how it, how they work. Okay, you guys. Yeah, you're. Okay, you're doing good. Okay, let's see if we can see the drones. We can. Look at them. Wait, what? Ah, really? Okay. Launching drones. I can't believe that happened. But yeah, we can repair our ships now. Quite interesting. Okay. That puts me right back in the flag range. Yes, sir. And the best part is, since the flag is not point blank range, but a, an area a bit to the side, they can actually do it without any problems. Also, I think uh, they are dead. Odd. By the way, how's the boarding party? I don't like what I see! Oh, it's full defensive, so not much I can do. Okay. Missiles incoming! Come on, come on, come on, come on! Okay, they're hitting the flag. Good. Subsystem repairs are complete. Neat. Okay, their borders are getting repelled, that's good. Okay, how's the hole? It's getting repaired. Good to, good to see. Now, Minerva! You've been uh, holding back your guns for uh, far too long. <laughs> oh, right there. Also, you guys move up. Next turn, I want your guided missiles to On fire. It, okay, so let's see Minerva, Castle Flak, you got your target. Good. Uh, are you done with the Raiders? I think you are. Neat. Okay. I need a target. For the missiles afterwards, so. Yes, sir. Understood. Okay, the vapors should do good. Enough job spotting you. Okay, focus fire the 
on the new Battlestar. Yeah, I think they are the fighters. That's awesome. <laughs> That's a lot of missiles. Also known as a lot of voices firepower. So, how much damage did you do? Actually, why did this this mark way? Okay, so. Okay, we're doing damage. Good to see. And the whole pointing. You can actually see the drones repairing the whole pointing. Which is actually damaged. Well, quite. It's a. Uh... <laughs> Strong word. But you know what I mean. Okay. Like so. So say we all. Okay. Artemis. Ah, they still hit. Minotaur is taking damage. Annoying. But it's getting repaired, so we're good. Okay. On it, Commander. The flag isn't going to save the Minotaur from that barrage, so we're positioning it. So it is on the bright side. You know, you know. Now the Jupiter no longer needs to hold back. And the Artemis, the same. Actually, focus fire on the bigger one. On a related note, my two support ships... <laughs> right, uh, this... Their supply, they don't actually fire them, they restock the missiles. I'm an idiot. But it makes sense, actually. Well, in that case, let's use them. Let's see, not in the way. Nope. Nope. And if they fire right now, I don't think they will be either, so... Don't hit my... Right, the MP mine, I forgot about that. Uh, go... Over there. Okay, nobody's flacking. Nope, nope, nope. Okay. Okay, everybody has their job. Bump the way! By the way, how's their... Okay, so let's see. That's quite some damage. And the Minerva's pack a punch. On it, Commander. Oh, they actually show how much it was repaired. Nice. Okay, you now keep focusing fire. Next. Okay, you guys. I mean, you. Guys, I'm doing marvels at to the base star, but uh, I got a new job for you. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, so the EMP mines are gonna explode soon. On okay, Minerva, flak. Minotaur. Understood. 
Now, don't you two dare hit each other. Yes, sir. Yeah, like so. Get a big blood. Don't you... You guys keep doing what you're doing. Now, the battle stars. <laughs> you know, just for the walls, I'm thinking about running the base star. Just for the walls, actually. By the way, is the... Is the boarding party dealt with? Yes, it is. Okay, full force. Let them have it. Alright, you can use torpedoes now. Well, fire away. Oh, frack! They... Flack. Okay. Fire away at the other battle base star. Otherwise, they're gonna be useless. Missile tubes prepped. Okay. Bomb the light. Perfect. Perfectly executed maneuver. Oh, yes. Wait, no. Wow, that's a problem. Let's see. The top. The bottom. The bottom. Man, it's hard to keep this Minotaur alive. I know I could use the Vipers to protect him, but... Actually, no buts. So let's use the Vipers to protect him. Okay. They've taken care of the vipers, the other vipers, so... Two squadrons should be enough. And, uh, you know, let's hope that they hit the bottom. You're still focusing fire, aren't you? Yeah, I'm seriously yes, tempted to just run my Artemis. Just for the walls! <laughs> also, how's the broadside going? Not as much as I would as I like to see. Okay, another EMP mine. Oh! The support ships. Well, people, fire will. Missiles incoming. Okay, where's it? The left, the bottom. Good. Phew. Okay. Repair the bottom. <laughs> okay, now that's done. Let's put the level and the full blown broadside. Where do And again! Look, I'm going to do it! I'm going to ram a battle star into the base star, just for the walls. Am I? Oh, the decision! I... You know what? I'm gonna do it! Just for the walls! Let's ram the Artemis into the base star. Let's see if he comes out intact. He's not, obviously. Okay, let's see this masterpiece. Oh, he's running away! Ooh, it's gonna hit, it's gonna hit! It hit! Woo! 
<laughs> oh, that's funny. Oh, that's funny. You know, in what in Chrome, uh, it wasn't the battle star. It was a cruiser, if I'm not mistaken. Actually, it did this. But, you know, they actually needed Understood. the nukes to finish the job. Okay, now. Are you dead yet? Almost. Okay, let's... The Minotaur can finish off... Uh, the Argus, so... Oops, my bad. Okay. Understood. And... Yes, Commander. On a related right note, well, you're doing that, so can't keep doing. Okay, you go after the support ship. That's actually a good job for the Vipers. Okay. Good, good. Come on! Oh, come on, really? Oh! You don't say. And the other one... Uh, I did... You... Yeah, it's for the front, okay. So, that's why I'm not firing, I'm not doing almost any damage, I'm firing, are they gonna ram as well? <laughs> okay, you guys, leave that to the battle stars. Yes, sir. Okay, the Minotaur can finish off the, this Argus. My... Jupiter is tearing this one apart. I mean, this isn't even funny. Just a sheer amount of pain it's dishing out. The Minerva will take the Cerberus out. You know, as soon as it... Can you go further down? Yeah, you yes, can. Good. And my Vipers will take care of the support ships. Okay. Missiles incoming! Big freaking deal! Minotaur is taking damage! Hostile unit identified. Point blank range, boys! Oh, and you're. Okay, that explains why it was taking so long. Yes, Commander. Anyway. Raptors are ready. Okay, good. Okay, seeker. Sick. Missile tubes prepped. There, <laughs> it's almost dead. So the missiles will finish him off. Then it's up to the Cerberus, which the Minerva is currently having an absolute blast against. Come on! There we go! Come on! Ah, so close! I think the missiles are gonna finish it. Any which way. Torpedo the way! Okay, so the Vipers are targeting who now? 
good, 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 good. And Hydra is going bye bye. So, no. focus fire on the other Hydra. Oh, that's gonna be a slaughter. Come on, let's see. How fast can a Minotaur. Oh, he's not in range. Frack. Anyway, let's see your Hydra explode. Nice. Nerva. As well. How about you can see the difference? Okay, now. And actually, 300 isn't it significant. In the difference drones. between a, a mangled ship and a destroyed ship. So. Yes, sir. Well, fire. It's almost dead. Oh, it's restocking. Nice. And the other hydro is already dead. Not quite. Still here. Oops. At this rate, the vip yeah, the vipers are going to kill it. Oh well. That's awkward. Okay, so the service is the only one left with any semblance of help. Okay, and come on, good, destroyed, and then there was one. Oh, you are going nowhere. Yes, you are going nowhere, boy. Oh yes, boy, Commander. they're Cylons, so toasters. Okay. Time to turn them around. And fire our newly restocked missiles. <laughs> Other than that, there's... Well, you've done your job. Man, they had so many more Vipers, I actually... Well, it's betting a bit more of a challenge. I mean, I know Colonial Vipers are supposed to be better, but not that much. Ah, there we go! Ah, <sighs> relaxing. I think it actually... They also... No, I think it's just armor. Okay, people. And that was the battle. Those were the new units. And, uh, well... So far, I think... Uh, I'm having fun with these new units. Though... The fact that... Uh, there is an option to, you know... Just straight up play the new missions. It's a minus, but then again, this DLC is quite cheap. Seven bucks if I'm not mistaken. Seven or eight bucks if I'm not mistaken. And, you know, for eight missions and a lot of variety in the new campaign? Yeah, sure! Buy it! But I did, and I'm not regretting it. Oh! And the replays are more stable! Now, that's something I like to see. So, both sides launch their Vipers. Dramatically! As we see the Minerva, the Jupiter, and the support ships at the back. The Vipers charge at the enemy, and the Mark Ones, which have a big ass target in their backs apparently, got slaughtered. Well, one squadron anyway. Then missiles came from the one nemesis that got completely not ranked. I mean, come on, three battle starts and. Uh, <laughs> One Minotaur? Yeah, that's not a fair fight. And still, the flag still works quite, quite well. And they, these ships feel Cylon in Colonial. Mostly, the most important of all, they feel like they belong in the universe. 
once in a while new ships don't, you know, in some series, but they don't have this problem in here. I could actually uh, see any of these ships fighting with and against Galactica in the series. And again, I have this sense that I've seen uh, the support ship in the series. If I'm not mistaken, those were, those were some of the civilians. But some of the civilian ships, you know, it makes sense from a certain point of view. <laughs> oh, come on, I want. And yeah, that was just uh, maneuvering. But that's not the point. The point is, I want to see the. Not the Argus, the Artemis. Ramming the base star. It's gonna be awesome. Ah, I still love this game. I haven't had much of a chance to play it lately because reasons, but I really do love this series. And I think uh, you saw the. That was supposed to be the MP mines, but the second round didn't actually. Oh! How come I didn't. That's that happening. The Minerva actually took a missile damage. Yeah, those were the MP mines. And here we go! Boom! <laughs> Not necessary, but it looks cool. Let's face it, it looks cool. the guns weren't in position, which is my problem with, uh, with the design in general. Unlike the battle stuff, which has, which has the firepower split evenly, the Manator only has two guns at the bottom. But since the that make? Space is 3D. Uh, anyway. I just did redeem himself uh, by shredding the supply ship. Hydra. You know, they might help, but my space, what else were they going to do? They wreck they wrecked the raiders in the initial confrontations, so Yeah. And I like it. The Minerva seems well designed and aggressive. You can see that it's the predecessor of the, the Mercury class, so I like it. Anyway, people, I hope you enjoyed this little, let's call it a review of the ELC. It was fun. Quite a lot of fun. So, until next time, don't forget to like, subscribe, and you know the deal. Till then, I'll see you around. Ta-ta!